Think about the hadith by Hazrat Anas radiallahu ta'ala anhu, and there are many, many, many sayings of the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa pertaining to this. The Holy Prophet Muhammad peace be upon him said, I want you guys to think, those of you who remember this hadith. He said there are four women who are the women of paradise and he announced them in advance that they are the special prominent women and says that they will be the women of paradise. Who were those women? Was it Khadija radiallahu ta'ala anha? Was it Fatima, Khadija, the Prophet's wife? Fatima radiallahu ta'ala anha, his daughter? Was it Maryam alayhi salatu wasalam, the mother of Jesus, peace be upon him? And Asya, peace be upon her, the wife of Pharaoh? Look at, have you, do some pondering. All of these four women, Out of these four women, you did not have Salah implemented five times a day. Yes, in the time of Moses and Jesus and everyone else, they prayed. So Maryam wasalam, prayed. They didn't pray this style of five times Salah in four akats and two akats. It was a different type of Salah. Well, let's stick to Khadija radiallahu ta'ala. Out of all his wives, huh? Out of all the 11 wives or the 9 wives, as the Muhadithin have said, the wife that he says that Jannah is promised for her is Khadija radiallahu ta'ala now. What is so special about her? Did she build masjids? They did not build masjids in those days. The first masjid was only built after she died. One year practically within the year when she died. She died in Ramadan. And in the next day, Rajab, the Prophet Sallallahu ascended to the heavens on Miraj and he got the gift of Salah. Salah was commanded after she passed away. When the Prophet, peace be upon him, went into Medina, it is then he built the first masjid. So Khadija radiallahu ta'ala anha wasn't praying five times a day in a masjid. She didn't build no masjid. But out of all the wives who prayed in masjids, Khadija radiallahu ta'ala anha is the one he promised Jannah and said she's that woman of Jannah. That's very authentic. Everybody knows that. What was two of those special things she did in her life? She spent, she was a wealthy woman. She was a wealthy woman. And she spent her money in dawah because the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wasallam, when he was married with her, he got the revelation of the Quran. And he started to give the dawah. And she st he stopped working. He used to work for her before. In her business. He stopped working. And he started giving dawah. Feast of Allah. Inviting people to God. And she maintained him financially to do that. And what was the next thing she did? She used to help the poor. She used to do what? She used to feed the poor. She used to clothe the poor. Whenever the Prophet Sallallahu speak of a poor person, she would finance them and help them. And she was promised Jannah. He always boasted of this wife to his other wives after she passed away.